Well, first of all, what's very important to people is workflow. Um, you know, a lot of staffs are not what they used to be. Uh, and so one of the things that we've always focused on is how to reduce the time it takes to do anything related to our platform. So it's very easy to upload any photo or video content, to publish it out to the sites or multiple sites. Also with a company like Tribune, they have a very easy ability to share that content across all their network. So whether the Chicago Tribune or KTLA Television or uh, KSWB Fox 5 in San Diego wants that same content, one of the things we have through our network is the ability for anybody within the Tribune network to easily get content from one site or another and share that around. The other thing that we believe in very strongly and more and more of our publishers are as well is incorporating user generated content. But not doing it without knowing what's going to happen and what kind of content that is. Because obviously lots of advertisers as well as sites themselves are concerned as to what's going to go live on their site. We have a very unique human review process, which 24 hours a day, seven days a week, when somebody from the outside loads a content, whether a video or photo, to your site, our people, which work, again, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, will moderate that content to ensure that it doesn't have copyright or license uh, issues, as well as it's appropriate for your site based on your guidelines, not our guidelines. So this human review process, it's not a software filter, it's eyeballs watching whole videos. And one of the things that's really important with, with user-generated content is making sure that it's quickly live on a site. Somebody could load a three-minute video and we would review it and within 20 minutes it will be live on the site if it meets all the guidelines. What that also proliferates is the first thing that user wants to do when they see that, that video live is share it with all their friends. And so you're actually creating a viral nature by bringing people who may never go to your site to your site, which adds a, an interesting dimension of how to use user-generated content in a protected way. Who's using that now? Most of our publishers are using our human review process now. So all the Lee Enterprise papers, the McClatchy papers, many of the Tribune papers. People can opt out if they want to review the content themselves, but most people, uh, you do a promotion with 5,000 videos being uploaded, you're not going to have the time to, to go through all 5,000 videos where we have the staffing to do that.